Young and the restless spoilers hello everybody. Elena Dawson's birthday celebration will get underway at the Grand Phoenix. Devon Hamilton will make a toast, with Mariah Copeland, Tessa Porter, Abby Newman, and Nate Hastings also in attendance. Mariah will shoot out to the car to retrieve Elena's gift and promptly run into Amanda Sinclair, whose appearance will stun her. but that he is sending paperwork overnight so that Catherine Chancellor's true wishes can be honored. After she leaves, Elena will cut the party short, and Mariah will be very upset by the whole scene. Next on Y&R, back at Devon's penthouse, he'll lament that Amanda put a damper on Elena's birthday. Although Hillary is dead, Mariah still can't forget her feud and always had the thought of revenge whenever she met her. After Mariah tried to talk to Amanda, she showed a non-cooperative attitude, partly because she didn't know anyone here, or Mariah kept mentioning Hillary. Whom Amanda was tired of being Genoese people mention and assign. Mariah was furious with that attitude. She kept shouting at Amanda's face and showed a desire to fight. Kyle will comfort Summer Newman, Hunter King who will still be in shock over Victor's death, he'll think she should go home. But she'll insist on staying at work. They'll work on a presentation that Kyle needs to give, and Kyle will be grateful for all her help, she's his secret weapon. Jack will then arrive and the three will share some nice moments together. Jack will pledge his support to Summer given what she's going through right now. Ray will think that she's keeping something from him still, and he'll think it's good that she cut herself free from Adam. Ray will wonder what's next for her, and Sharon will note that she wants a fresh start. Thank you and goodbye.